just like T.C. Barnum said, what's the, there's a sucker born every minute. You know who else said that to us? Yeah. The Jamaican scammer. The exact same line. That is absolutely true. Adam? Uh-huh. Brace yourself. Are you braced? You've won 19.42 million US dollars. How'd you feel? Okay, how is that possible? Adam, do you eat out? Yes. Are you vegetarian? Uh-huh. Oh my God, Adam, you ran your credit card at a Whole Foods store. Have you had Whole Foods recently? Yeah, all the time. Adam, you've won. You've won. What are you going to do with 19.42 million dollars? Hey, Adam, if you're watching, I want you to know that this call is a scam. Adam's a sucker. <laughs> Adam, you're not a sucker, but the guys on the other line are hoping, really hoping that you are. I would be shocked too. Adam, I've never won anything, man. How are you so lucky? They make a living in a way that's obviously wrong. But imagine waking up every morning and seeing a bunch of tourists spending more money in a week than you make in a year and then going home to a place outside resort walls that were erected to keep you out. Historically, I don't think the, the scales have been set right yet, you know what I mean? Now imagine all this is wrapped in a history of slavery and exploitation, a legacy that is very much alive and well. There's been no compensation for colonialism and the 400 years of slavery. It's reverse imperialism. Reverse imperialism. Yeah, we, we take taking resources that are readily available. Most youth are unemployed. If you have a phone, you have a chance. If you have a phone, you have a chance. It's the most powerful rationalization I've heard. Phone scamming as a last resort, a literal lifeline. Even so, most scammers I met seem to struggle with what they do. Little jungle out here. Right, right, right. I know Tweety does. Almost there, Mary, and almost there. Dude, spider web. <laughs> yeah. Just down here? Yeah. You good? This is really cool. Is it cold? Yeah. <laughs> so you're in Jamaica. You have black magic everywhere. We believe in wash-offs. So we wash off the crosses, the bad luck. So this is to ward off the evil spirits? Right. We call them dopey, but you guys say ghosts, right? Ghosts, yeah. And you mix that with water? Water. Okay. Oh, it's getting wet. Wow, it's raining. It's raining a lot. So I got you know? <laughs> Extra blessings. I'm going to join you since I'm totally wet already okay. anyway. There's no point in me pretending here. I'm going to go pick up. I did this one, you know? Yeah, one, two, three. I've spent a lot of time with people like Tweety, telling stories of those who make a living on the wrong side of the law. All too often, the people who inhabit these worlds are painted as ruthless criminals, immoral villains, bad people. But in my experience, they are a lot more like us than we want to admit. Some people have it hard, some people have it easy. This whole life is... Fresh start, new beginning, right? Fresh start, new beginning. Everything is, is a scam. Everybody takes their piece. Who's making money off of these industries? Everyone. It funds entire countries. What would make you stop doing it? If I'm a billionaire, I'll be done. I'm helping a lot of people with this. Family, friends, everybody. Will I ever stop scamming? 
No, it's too much fun. How do you think this is gonna end for you? That's it. That's it. It's the life. Life goes on. We are in. Get it. All right. <laughs>